Merry meet everybody. It's Poe, your Friday hostess, and you're watching Witches of the Moon. This week on the channel, we are talking about working with magical beings. Um, this can be, I guess, anything from like fairies to um, spirit animals to um, you know dragons, mirror people, that kind of thing. Um, I personally have never worked with any magical being. I just haven't really felt a call to do that. Um, I think really the only way that I've ever actually worked with a magical being is um, I have a deck of fairy oracle cards that I use for readings from time to time and that's really it. Um, so this is going to be kind of a short video, but my lack of experience aside, um, I think as with anything that you do on this path, I think that it's important to um, do your research, do your homework, um, really understand um, what you're kind of inviting into your magical space, your, your, your sacred space, your home, that sort of thing. Um, because like with everything, there's a balance um, of energy. So when, say, like you want to work with the fairies, do your research, make sure you understand the pros and cons of working with fairies because while I'm sure there are many great benefits to working with them. There's also a lot of um, things that come along with inviting fairies into your, your sacred space or your home that might not be desired. So it's kind of taking into consideration the pros and cons of working with particular magical beings that really needs to be kind of analyzed first. Um, also, another thing that I think is pretty important is um, when you do decide that you, you genuinely want to work with these beings, make sure that, um, you know, the homework aspect, but the intent needs to be genuine because if it's not you, I, I've never ever seen anybody that's had, you know, superficial intent or something like that and it's worked out well for them. So kind of like with any ritual or spell or anything that you're doing, the intent has to be genuine. So um, if you're just, you know, you really admire the way that they look and you think it would be cool to be like, yeah, I work with fairies. Um, if there's not a genuine reason why, if, if your intent is not pure, it, it's probably not going to go so great. So um, making sure that you do your research on whatever magical being you're looking into working with, but also making sure that your intent in working with those magical beings is, is genuine and pure. So um, yeah, um, really that's all I can say about the subject because of my lack of experience, but um, those are things that I have run across in um, discussing the subject with other people um, and reading experiences from other people and that sort of thing. So just a couple things to keep in mind when you are planning on working with um, magical beings and and creatures and things um, but yeah so that's my video um, I know it's short but there it is um, anyway thank you so much for watching I hope you've enjoyed if you like what you see um, please feel free to comment like subscribe if you haven't already um, and we will be talking to you next week. Many blessings. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend, and 